I need more power. I don't have enough space. Cordonon is just ahead. The Each of you has always been stubborn in your own way. Stubborn to have it your way. Stubborn to never give up. Stubborn to live. Why are you helping the Covenant of the Blind? Why them? You have much to answer for. I have warned you time and time again. I have warned you to go your own way. Not once did you listen to me. Edric died because of it. And now you're forcing my hand yet again. For how long have you been manipulating the purifiers? You overestimate me, child. I am but a thrall. Ariman deceived me. I paid for that mistake by losing most of my free will, keeping just enough of it to masquerade as a Grand Inquisitor, and for a few, as a father. In truth, I have been preparing the coming of Ariman for a time that feels like an eternity to me. You manipulated the Senate so that the purifiers would crush the Brotherhood of Dawn's resistance against Ariman. Your will was not your own. I get it. But why did you not tell us? I am but a slave. Letting you know would have only put you in harm's way. We can still free you from Araman. There's got to be a way. I'm bound to him with a pact. Something that cannot be undone. 
You should run. Now. He won't accept further interference in his plans. There is no fate more cruel than taking the life of your own children. Resist his call, father! It's pointless. I'm sorry, children. <laughs> Fight back! You can resist! I will make it painless, daughter. Valeria! What are you waiting for? Do it! Nothing but a slave. Come on then, do it! Nothing but a slave! Enough games, daughter! Thralls deserve no family! Not right. Manage that right now. to run after Hemlock. That's not what we came here for. The Hellion first. I don't care. We have to either save or kill him. There's no other way. We will in time. I promise. He almost killed you once. You're not going anywhere near him in that state and you know it. Val, can you fight? 
The human female is highly likely to die without our intervention if she further pushes her body to its limits. Shut up. Can you walk? I think so. All right. I will take you back to Genes. Come. Wait. We didn't come all the way here to leave empty-handed. We're at Cordon's Gate. Get the bloody artifact. She is correct. If it is the Hellion you are after, then we happen to know its exact location, deep into the heart of our domain. Please honor us and accept our invitation. We shall end your life close to we. I'm not leaving her behind. If she is a reason for you not to accept our invitation, then we shall see her home, unharmed, unchanged, weak and ever dying. Would that please you? No deal. She's not entering alone on the off chance that you might have what we want. Fine, Lambak. Show me to the Hellion, but don't harm her. What? You're not truly considering it. It might be many things, but clearly it's not a liar. Two stairs, for two fates. The wounded female goes home unharmed, while you enter our domain to cease existing. It will be an honor. Yes. Today is a good day for all of us. Get your ass back safely, all right? Thank you for shielding me against Hemlock. You're being foolish! Feels strange not to be the fool for once. All right. This must be where Cordonan's contamination started. You got this. Don't turn around. Okay. Don't show your nervous. Lambak, I'm coming! Wherever you're hiding. Hiding? As our honored guest, we do not hide. We are all around you.
I need more power. is waning. to catch my breath.
carry that. Not happening. It's not possible. We must have lived and progress faster than expected. There is something we want to share with you, but it is not quite true. The only thing you should share right now is the Helion. Valeria, answer me! We are doing so much more. When we are done, she will be much stronger than she ever was. Are you not grateful?
That's not happening. 